We are looking back on a goalless draw for the Rapids on Saturday night against the new boys Charlotte FC, a third shutout of the season for William Yarbrough. And I mean, we talk about Diego Rubio hit the woodwork in the first half. If it wasn't for some big saves, including a double save from Yarbrough, Charlotte are walking out with a win. Yeah, I think when you talk about keepers, you had to talk about they have to make two or three big saves. But tonight, William Yarbrough was huge because there were two or three saves he's got to make. And listen, the basic ones are there. But again, you're coming out, you've got to close the ball down. You see Shavarsi coming inside here. This shot here, reactionary save. He gets up quickly, going the wrong way. He comes back with his right hand. Then Gaines comes in here. He makes a great save. And this is a tough save across his body. He doesn't want to give up a rebound, but you got Colorado players right there to help him. He, to me, was the man of the match. The fact that he kept them in the game, especially when Colorado was not going through a good period. Big moments for William Yarbrough and a debut, I was going to say MLS debut, a debut, a Rapids debut for Jassy Zardes. What do we make? It, it was tough. It was a tough game for him to yeah. come into. He's been here less than 24 hours. With a week here, we're expecting him to be up to speed by next weekend? Is, yeah. 24 hours after you've been traded is very difficult. Very difficult because you've got so many things going through your head. So Jazzy had to come in, came in late, got to the stadium, got to see some video, then he got an opportunity to play, which I think as a player makes you feel better, it calms you down. It'll take him a week or so to understand the system, where he fits in in the system. But the important thing was, is he got in here, he got an opportunity to play, and he got an opportunity to play with his teammates tonight. Absolutely. A goal to straw for the Rapids, a club record, 20 games unbeaten at home, but just the point, the Rapids unbeaten in five, they'll try and get the W next weekend. Home to Portland Timbers, coverage on altitude from 6.30, kickoff at Dick's Sporting Goods Park at 7 o'clock. We will see you then. Bye for now.